thing you've managed to do um, is release a new gaming app that I've been playing all morning. I was like, oh, I'll just check it out. Um, it turned out to be the best interview prep I've ever done. I, I was just playing a game all morning. It is really addictive. <laughs> Thank you. Our, our videos all kind of intertwine, and this is an extension of that. And um, what's great about it is you can unlock things in the app that we will be able to use in our YouTube videos. So it's, it's a fun, interactive way. On top of the game, for me, at least it's addicting. I was really bad at first, but obviously I was like, I can't be bad at my own game. Yeah. So like now I'm good, but like so many people have much higher scores than me. Like it's crazy how good like everyone else is versus me. So it's tough. I mean, like the game's tricky because you put like the little, like the magnet and the, um, and the puzzle pieces, like, Right where it's hard to jump, like right over a bunch of, right over right, a bunch there's of spikes. Like spikes. Yeah, I'm like, and I'm playing. I'm like, is it worth it? Should I go for it? I should, <laughs> should I just try and stay alive? And the better you do, the faster it goes. So it kind of gets intense. All right. And so, Rebecca, how did where did that idea come from to to make a game? Um. Well, I I've always wanted some type of app. Again, it's it came from this whole idea of like, how can we connect? even more with our audience and engage more. And so obviously it's a game right now. And, you know, uh, and, and obviously I love the game, but we have so many other ideas within the app. Like if, building the app was step one, having a game, having like whatever they can find in that game help us in videos. Um, but I wanna use the app more to connect with my audience. Um, and so this is V1, but there's like a lot of, a lot more things that uh, are coming, which we're really excited about. And I made sure that it was free to download. And I also made sure that there are no ads on the game because I hate playing games. And then, you know, something like five seconds in, you have to tap on an ad. So I made it, um, it was really specifically for, for our audience. Great, so, wow, what a, what a gift to the world during the oh, yeah. Man, I, and, and Rebecca, like, obviously, I'm assuming that's the first time you've ever delved into the world of, you know, making an app and making a game. Like, was it, was it harder than you expected? Was it easier than you expected? What was the process like? Um, we had, you know, a lot of meetings um, creating it. I, I guess for me, I was, I was in on the process, um, but luckily we had uh, a develop, like a company that actually does that. And so yeah. it was really cool to see um, our vision come to life with them. You know, they, they then had to watch our videos and understand how, what our world is. And yeah. um, I think they did a really great job. And again, you guys are only seeing V1. Um, so, you know, there's more coming. Obviously I'm the only one in the game right now, but there'll soon be other people in it and it, it'll get more advanced. Um, wow, but it okay. was it was a it was a fun process. Again, I love doing things that I've never done before, and I just kind of like wing it. Um, and I'm I'm really happy with how it turned out, and they nice. did a great job. So interrupting this video for ten seconds to tell you about Herdwell's playlisting. We partner with all your favorite creators to make playlists with their favorite tracks for you to enjoy. <sighs> Link in the description box below. Right, right, and Rebecca, tough might be a tough question, but. Can you think of any like any little hidden gems, any Easter eggs, anything that people might not know, or any secrets about the app they should look out for when they're when they're playing next? Um, uh, secrets. I'm, I'm well, I will started. say if if you get through all of it, which people already have, um, there is a four digit code, and I haven't even gotten the code yet, so they're they're ahead of me. Um, but there is a four digit code which will, would mean that you, you know, got everything that you needed to for this portion of the game. And then okay. again, something else will be coming, so. Okay, so once you get the footage of code, then, it, then it, what, it unlocks something? Well, hopefully we're gonna be able to use it in one of our videos. Okay. So, yeah, so we, we are hoping people get that four digit code. I'm playing, but like my high score is like 700. There's people in the thousands. Like, it's crazy how good people are at this game so yeah. much better than me. My brother was like number one on the leaderboard for like a second and he was like, oh, I'm so good. And then like 10 people beat him within like a couple hours. He thought oh, he was like God. so cool. Wait, someone just said their highest score is 2789. That's crazy. 
Mine is like 700 and I've played the game a lot. I'm trying to break a thousand. So. Wow. Okay. Yeah. Cody Carb Carbo has the code. We got, we got a few professionals over here. That's yeah. And if anyone gets a higher score than 700 today, um, screenshot it and tag me and I'll DM you. Cause you're, if you're better than me, then I, I should at least like shout you out. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Doesn't take go. much though. All right. What do you say we uh we take a couple of fan questions? You alright with that, Rebecca? I'm down. Underscore Alyssa's written. Okay. What is your favorite thing in your very big closet? <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh, yeah, my closet is like crazy. Um, what's my favorite thing? Well, what's funny is like there's this top row, and it was like I was like, what are you supposed to put in there? It's like so high. How do you get to it? And they're like, oh, all your designer purses. I'm like. Oh, okay. I don't have those. So, um, but my favorite thing is I, I love there's like a little island in the middle and there's like a seat for someone to sit on yep. and my dogs sit on it. So like, I'll be like getting dressed and they're just like watching me. So like, I, I like that part. It has nothing to do with my clothes, but like, that's my favorite part. Good answer. Good answer. I like that. Okay. Someone's asked, um, Rebecca, are you going to be getting on Reels if you aren't already? What do you think about that over TikTok? Um, I I'm on Reels. I started it. I haven't um, I haven't done as much on it as like TikTok. And, and the thing is, is like Reels is like what, like it's at V one. It's like the first stage. Like so, it's very basic right now. And I yep. know it'll get more advanced. Um, but I, I think it's like always good to be on everything and test it out. I mean. Obviously, TikTok's TikTok, um, but this is their version of TikTok. Um, and I, you know, I think it's, it adds a little more fun to Instagram, you know, um, yeah. because you can do those like weird videos that maybe used to not fit on TikTok or on Instagram and there's like a place for them now. So I, I'm open to it. Like, it's still so new. Um, yeah. I, it's definitely not as like good with like editing and all of that, like TikTok yeah. is, um, but I mean, it, they just started, so I'm, I'm yeah. curious to see where it goes. Okay, okay, nice. Um, okay, someone's written, what do you, well, first of all, do you watch, do you get time to watch TV? If you do, what do you, what are you binge watching? Um, Doomsday Preppers. Yeah. It's like this show where they like prep for the end of the world <laughs> and they do like bunkers. It's like, anyways, I watch that. I, I watch weird things, I guess. But yeah, Doomsday Bunk or Doomsday something, it's like really fun. So yeah. That's amazing. Okay, someone's written, um, who would you love to collaborate with in a video that you haven't collaborated with yet? Ooh, um, well, I have, uh, let's see, I have one, there's a lot of people I'd love to collab with. I'd be, I, I, I think Mr. Beast does such great, like, um, great things, and yeah. it would be cool to do something with him, something with charity or donating to someone, because his videos always make you feel good at the end. Like, he's giving someone a house or like, you know, $50,000, like he always does these crazy things, and it would be fun to like, be a part of giving back, you know, the way he does, because yeah. I think that's awesome. And, and like, yeah, he's similar to David Dobrik in that, isn't it? Like, yeah. giving away these incredible things, that's amazing. If you like what you saw, make sure you check out some of our other videos right here, and also be sure to subscribe to our channel right here for new videos coming out every week.